Tonight, there is outrage from the parents of a dead Navy medic after another medic who was accused in his death was found in part not guilty. Our ABC 10 News investigative reporter Jennifer Castor spoke to the parents today who have alleged a military cover up in their son's death on a Southern California military base. The deceased medic's parents told me it was painful sitting in court next to the parents of the other medic who was accused in connection to their son's death. The Marines have now confirmed that a military trial last week for this 23 year old Navy corpsman, a type of medic, resulted in only a partial conviction after he was accused in connection to the death of a fellow corpsman. 30 year old Michael Vincent de Leon died in a shooting on the 29 Palms base northeast of San Diego. This was uh, difficult, very emotional. On Wednesday, ABC 10 News spoke to his parents who were in the courtroom when Mason Williams was found guilty of dereliction of duty and disorderly conduct. He was found not guilty of reckless endangerment and violation of lawful general order. As punishment, his rank will drop from E4 to E1, resulting in a pay reduction. The De Leons wanted him to be discharged. Reduction in rank is, is far less severe of a punishment than you could have ever hoped for. Yeah, for sure. Williams is one of five corpsmen who've been connected to his death. The De Leon said their son captured Snapchat video before he was shot during a going away party with fellow corpsmen at one of the houses on base. The prosecution has said that the corpsmen were drinking and dry firing guns before a fatal round was fired. The De Leon's alleged a cover up after ABC 10 News confirmed through sources with close military ties that their son's death was being investigated as a homicide, not a suicide like they said they were first led to believe. They said Williams has apologized Apologized, but it's not enough. You know, apologizing without accepting what he did was wrong doesn't, for us, our son is gone. Our son is gone. Aside from Williams, three other corpsmen have been charged. A fourth corpsman is facing charges, but his hearing was continued and a date has not been set. Jennifer Kastner, ABC 10 News.